Miss Booksy. Make sure you click that subscribe button so that you never miss any of my amazing adventures. Can't wait to see you soon for more story time. Hi kids, it's time for a brand new bedtime story here at Cool School. I'm Miss Booksy and this is... Walla and Zorro. Hi. Today we're reading chapter seven of Beauty and the Beast. At the end of chapter six, Belle had just been summoned home to take care of her sick dad. I hope he's okay. And I hope the beast doesn't get too lonely. Same. Well, let's see what happens. Wiggle, snap, story time. The beast was lonely. He puttered around the house in his pajamas and made noises like this. I'm so lonely. Oh no, he's so sad. Ah, poor Sam. Yeah, he wasn't doing so great. Belle, on the other hand, was so happy to see her dad again. Dad, oh, I miss you so much. I'm gonna make you some of my famous chicken foot soup. <laughs> It'll whip you right into shape. Hold up, chicken foot soup? Hey, don't knock it till you try it. It's a delicacy. Whatever you say, Zorro. But Belle wasn't all smiles. She missed her friend. I wonder what old Sam is up to right now. <sighs> right, that. Anyway, while Belle had missed her dad, she realized she hadn't really missed her siblings at all. Uh, Belle, we didn't think you were coming back, so we put all your stuff in storage. Except for the good stuff, we kept that. We get to keep it, finders keepers. You understand. Sure, guys, whatever. <laughs> What's wrong with you? You look all blah. Rude. Have you been crying because you miss your hairy beast friend? Oh, Belle has a boyfriend. Belle has a boyfriend. He's not my boyfriend. He's just my friend. You should marry him. He is rich. He's rich? OMG, Wiz. He's so rich. Uber rich. Like, he probably has a gazillion dollars. Good thing he's a giant beast. That way, no one will rob him. <laughs> he looks like his own guard dog. Gee, I wonder why she didn't miss her siblings all that much. I was being sarcastic. Could you tell? Yeah, kindness is not really their thing, is it? Suddenly, Belle's brother remembered something. That's it. What? When I was looking for the Beast Castle to bring back Belle, I stopped in a hunting lodge. Ew. I know. Anyway, I overheard these hunter guys talking about finding and capturing a beast. So? Well, we could tell them where he is, and then we can take all his rich stuff. The two started plotting their super mean, some might even say evil, scheme. Wait, no, they wouldn't, would they? They're totally gonna give up the beast, so mean. Can we help you, Sonny? You've been looking for a beast? I know where he is. Where? That'll cost you, and we're gonna need some help. The hunters promised to pay Belle's brother once he took them to the beast, but first, they needed a mob. A mob? What? You said first they need a mob? No, a mob. Like a group of not so nice people to help them take down the beast. Oh. Yeesh. This is getting scarier by the minute. When does the fairy tale happily ever after stuff start? Soon, I hope. <laughs> Let's keep reading and find out. Who here wishes to foil the odious beast? Huh? He means to say, who wants to go get that beast? Say I. Oh. I. Well, grab your pitchforks and let's go. Well, that was easy. And off the angry mob went to attack poor lonely Sam. No, someone has to stop them. Gustav, bring me more herbal tea and ice cream. Gustav, I'm in despair. <laughs> huh? What's that? Belle? Belle! Is that you? Oh, she's come back! Gustav, make that one ice cream two spoons! Belle, I'm so glad you... Ah! Uh, I mean... Roar. There he is! Get him! Belle is going to save the day. I just know it. Yeah, I bet she'll come besting in and show those bad guys who's boss. I hope so. Let's see. <gasps> Something's wrong. I can feel it. What? Go back to sleep. No, Sam's in trouble. Sam who? The beast. Oh yeah, the hunters are capturing him so we can take all his rich stuff. Oh no. 
She's totally going to save the day! We'll just have to read chapter eight to find out, won't we? Can we read it now? Please, pretty please, Miss Booksy. Pretty please with a cherry on top. Ooh, I do love cherries, but soon, I promise. Till then, what do we tell our friends? Make sure you subscribe to Cool School so you never, ever, ever miss a video. And follow us on Instagram and Facebook, too. Bye! Bye. See ya!